Hey, Psych2Goers, welcome back to another one of our videos. Before we begin, we'd like to give all of you a big thanks for all of the support that you've given us. Psych2Go's mission is to make psychology more accessible to everyone. On to the video. Have you ever felt like your success isn't because of you? Imposter syndrome is having the feeling of phoniness and believing that you'll be found as a fraud. An estimated 70% of people will experience imposter syndrome at least once in their lifetime. So learning about it may help reassure people that they're not the only ones experiencing it. And before we begin, we'd also like to mention that this video is created for educational purposes only and does not substitute a professional diagnosis. If you suspect you may have imposter syndrome, we recommend that you seek the advice of a counselor or licensed mental health professional. With that being said, here are six signs you might have imposter syndrome. One, you don't think you deserve your success. You feel like your success is because of luck or something other than your own hard work. Do you also refuse to believe in those who try to validate your success? A sign of imposter syndrome is attributing your success to external forces instead of acknowledging your abilities. In 1978, Clance and Amez interviewed successful women at the top of their fields and found that many of them felt that their success was due to luck or mistake rather than their own hard work. Two, you're a perfectionist or a procrastinator. Do you wait until the last minute to complete your work or put more time and effort into a project than necessary to make something perfect? If you have imposter syndrome, you may turn to procrastination and perfectionism as coping mechanisms for your feelings of inadequacy. You may wait until the last minute to start working or constantly overwork yourself so you can attribute your success to luck or hard work instead of your own abilities. Three, you're afraid of being exposed as a fake. Do you usually feel anxious and scared that your peers will realize you're a fake? Even famous American poet and author Maya Angelou was scared she'd be found as a fake whenever she published a new book. And this is due to imposter syndrome being linked to low self-confidence. Because of it, you may believe that you're untalented or that you need to work even harder so others won't notice your lack of talent or ability. Four, you fear failure. Do you feel really ashamed or humiliated when you fail at something? People with imposter syndrome tend to feel high levels of anxiety surrounding failure. You might replay your mistakes in your head, which can worsen your fear and overwhelm you. This fear of failure can parallel a need to be the best. Five, you need to be the best. Have you ever felt overwhelmed when you're in a competition full of people who are as successful as you? When you're so used to being the best, you might find it overwhelming to be in a situation where other people are also as good as you. In this case, you may be disappointed by your own abilities or feel as though you're an imposter. You might put yourself down or resort to calling yourself untalented to try to reconcile your feelings of underperformance in comparison to your peers. And number six, you constantly compare your success to others. Do you always compare yourself to people who are more successful than you? People with imposter syndrome may feel let down by their abilities when they compare themselves with others. This is especially true when comparing yourself to those who have more experience. You might feel guilty for not doing as well or for not achieving similar results as a professional. Do you struggle with imposter syndrome or know someone that does? Tell us about it in the comments below. If you liked this video, please like and share it with others who might find it helpful too. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more videos. All the references used are added in the description box below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.